be true to yourself, have opinions, have a voice. You don't have to be the good girl. You don't have to be the one who's always liked. It's okay to be controversial if that's truly um, what you believe. Um, I mean, make sure that you have a voice. No one's going to give you a voice. If you want to play a part in the world, you have to grab it. Well, my hope is that you know, moving into the future, we will not be in the position we're in today where less than 21% of women globally are in senior management positions, where so few women are still sitting at the tables um, of power, where we have so few women who are representing citizens in politics and so few women running big companies. I mean, my hope is that women will be firmly there um, at the table um, with power, with economic power, um, as well as voice. Uh, but we are far from that point at this, at, at, at this point, and that's why it's so wonderful to be speaking to young women who you know, themselves will be championing um, women and what women can do over the next decade. Well, the challenge is partly institutional, so part of the problem is a kind of self-reinforcing situation where because there aren't women already um, in these positions of power, or just very few, younger women don't have the role models to be able to kind of see, figure out, well, how do I get there and what are the steps I need to take in order to get to the point ideally I'd like to be. So older women need to be helping younger pe women and mentoring them and sharing their experiences. But younger women too need to be pooling their information and their resources, um, which you can do nowadays virtually as well. You don't have to be doing it just physically, meeting people, but you know, be involved in forums, discussions, as well as seeking out physical events where you can meet like-minded women and share your experiences and stories, struggles and hopes. It's not always easy. Um, there are moments when you do have doubts. There are moments when you have self-doubt. Um, there are moments when you know trying to achieve big things in your life feels lonely and difficult, um, and that's okay. I mean, those are just going to be transient moments in this journey towards creating a life for yourself and for others that is really meaningful. It's okay to not always feel 100% confident, but what's important and what I've learned is to just keep going. I mean, at the end of the day, there aren't really any shortcuts. It's a matter of hard work, tenacity, determination, and then you will get that.